Did someone say Forza Horizon 4 news? <sighs> Oh, we've got some juicy new Forza Horizon 4 news and I'm very excited to share those with you guys because they include things that a lot of people have been waiting for years now to pop up in a Horizon game. So let's just jump straight into it, let's not waste any more time. Drag slicks. Yes, we're gonna have proper drag tires for the very first time in a Horizon game. The developers actually confirmed this in a recent live stream. If you know me, if you know my channel, I love my dragsters. I love my drag cars, so I'm actually really excited to try this out. However, that's not gonna be the only drag upgrade we will have in Forza Horizon 4. Something in the form of drag suspension has also been confirmed to be featured in the game. Now they haven't really gone into detail on how it actually works and how it will affect the car. What they have said is that it will increase the performance of a car off the line. Now adding on to that, there's gonna be one more feature, new feature in Forza Horizon 4 for the very first time in the Forza series. Drift suspension, you already heard this before in recent like interviews and so on. However, they went into a bit more detail this time around in what actually is affected by the drift suspension, what the drift suspension actually changes um, if you look at the car, if you drive the car and so on. Now the very first thing the drift suspension can actually do is lower the car all the way down to the ground. So you can massively lower your car, you can pretty much slam it to the ground. Now another thing the drift suspension allows you to do is change the steering lock of the car. So if you take a normal Horizon car, the developer said you have a steering lock or possible steering angle from like 20 to 30 degrees. So that's like that much. Drift suspension allows you to massively change the steering lock all the way up to 50 degrees. 50 degrees and we actually have an official screenshot I'm gonna show right here. I'm not like a drifter sort of person but again if we get like proper drift upgrades I might be getting into that sort of stuff a bit more because it looks it looks pretty awesome. I'm very much looking forward to that one and yeah we will also get the drift suspension in Forza Motorsport 7 where we can actually have even more steering lock up to 60 degrees which is and the last thing the drift suspension actually allows you to do is change the steering angle faster. So you can go from like max lock to max lock on the other side faster if you upgrade to the drift suspension, which will allow you to control the car in a better way and also allow you to pull off some cooler drifts pretty much. And the next thing I wanted to touch on real quick, new cars. There's gonna be a Forza Motorsport 7 car pack in I think a week from now on, including the McLaren 720S, including the Ferrari 812 Superfast, Big fan of that car. We've also got the KTM Expo GT4, the 2018, the brand new Porsche 911 GT3 RS, the completely new one. The new GT3 RS model is gonna be a free car in Forza 7. Now, why do I mention that? Well, it's already been confirmed that the 720S is gonna be in Forza Horizon 4 as well as in Forza 7. Now, in my opinion, there is no reason why they wouldn't take the A12 Superfast from Forza 7 and put it into Forza Horizon 4. There's no reason for them not to do that because it's a car people wanted for quite a long time now and it's an awesome car. I'm 98% sure that we're gonna see some of those cars from the Forza 7 car pack also make an appearance in Forza Horizon 4 because let's face it, there's no reason why they wouldn't add it to their newest game to like increase the hype even more. But again, let me know what you think about that theory in the comments. And one thing has to be said here at this point, um, I think it's very clear that they have actually listened to the community for once. They have implemented quite a few features we wanted to see for years in Forza Horizon 4, which is just awesome. So a round of applause to Playground Games, that's huge. But yeah, drop a like if you like this video, subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this, Forza Horizon 4, Forza 7 and the Crew 2, and until next time, bye. <laughs>